Hi, it's Sam Tobert, Sound of Joy Music Services, and we're on to our next gospel piano tutorial, the song I Call You Faithful by Donnie McClurkin in the key of E flat. Let's practice our E flat scale. And back down. All right. So the opening chords are in the scales if you look at how it sounds. One more time. Just a note. Just changing the chord a little bit because you can do that with the scale. When you have chords that's part of the scale, you can mix the notes. All in the scales. So that's your right hand. Let's add the left hand in there. One more time. And I got to take my time so YouTube doesn't come after me. Drop two if you want to call it that. Then it comes down lower. And it resolves. So now that you can go and practice on your own and come back and we'll take you into the meat of the song. So the meat of the song is following a pattern. Now you could start in the one if you want, because it's going to go to the three, to the four. Now it's going to go to the three bass, but a one chord, to the four chord, to the, to the three bass with a one chord. Now back up to the four and to the five, six on the bass, seven on the bass, and back to the one. That is the generic pattern. that up try that again I'm trying to stay away from the algorithm and YouTube you know the words up pause and I'm trying to catch that timing for you but as you can see the chords generically are in the numbers are in the numbers one two three four five six seven eight and basic to the chord names. Now my left hand is playing bass, but it's also assisting with chords when needed. If I wanted to go up here. Timing is important. Trying to again defeat the AI listening to me. If you don't have this reach, this is fine. Uh, uh, uh. Now, what I'm 
going to do is I'm going to play along with the recording so that I can get that timing correct. So I'm going on mute. This is important. Give you the most correct recording from a learning standpoint as possible. So let me go play along with the with the video and get that timing down for you. Be right back. So it is quick. But well, again, when you listen to it, you will see where those chords fit. So that'll be your tempo which is a lot quicker than what, what the actual training is, but this is a actual tutorial. So when you come out of the, come out of the, from here you're gonna go right to the, um, to the D flat chord, which is basically shifting this hand over to the D flat or C sharp or D flat because it is a we're in the key of E flat drop down so hold you are and and right there so now you've got a good framework for the entire song there are not that many more chords that you can add but the way the song goes if you listen to the actual piano work they're all they are they are all over the place chord wise Again, I can't play it exactly like the album for this lesson, but you're seeing where the chords are found. They're in the range of the scales that we that we just practiced in the very beginning of the video. So I would implore you to go to the YouTube video of this song, take the chords I've shown you, and go practice. We'll cover the chords one more time for those that are that are still watching this video up to this moment. From the top. comes down walk up and then the opening chords flat comes bring it down hold this chord and right back into and 
and there you are. Gospel piano tutorial, where I call you faithful in the key of E flat. See you in the next video.